And let's start with West Hope Newburgh boys basketball winning their first state title in 37 years. Brandon, Brandon Gardner, talk to them after that championship win. It's been a long time coming for West Hope Newburgh basketball, but this group always knew that a change was going to come. And, oh yes it did. This, this group, uh, very talented. Um, we all know that, how talented they are, but just how well they play together, their toughness. Um, we, we knew this was in the cards for us. We really did. If we kept working and improving and uh, stay together. Two years ago, my freshman year, we really wanted to, we had a big discussion in uh, Co Coach Lee's room about our goals. You know, and that was one of the goals was to get to the state, state I mean, and then state championship. So it's something special. My freshman year, I knew we were going to go to state no matter what. I knew. Whether it was junior year, my junior year, or my senior year, I, I had faith in this group. I knew we were going to get it done. Every adversity, every failure, and every heartache carries with it the seed of an equal or greater benefit. The Sioux knew that going into the season. Each time I got the chance to talk with the Sioux, overcoming adversity was the recurring statement. With injuries. Sophomore year, we're bothered with injuries. I mean, now we're healthy and we're we're playing to the best of our ability. We're playing like a family. Overcoming adversity was definitely the motto for the Sioux this season. First, beating the Bishop Bryan team that beat them twice this year for the regional championship. Then, overcoming a 15-point deficit in the semifinal round to punch their ticket into the championship game. And then, in the finale where their star player got hurt, they never showed any signs of doubt. I knew my teammates would get me open for all the shots I got. They're wonderful teammates. I couldn't I couldn't think anything better for them. That's, that's what I practice. I practice my threes and to be able to come out here and hit them in big games like this, it's, it feels good. Leadership is unlocking people's potential to become better. That's definitely what head coach and coach of the year Anthony Lee has done this season, and his players know it. Dude, he deserves it. We love him. He's a great coach. He pushes us on and off the courts in school. He just works hard. He works just as hard as all of us. So. Coach, he's got us in the weight room. He's got us at team camps, open gyms in the summer. It, it's incredible what he does for us, and it shows. The great Vince Lombardi once stated that individual commitment to a group effort is what makes a team work, a company work, a society work, and a civilization work. West Hope Newburgh takes great pride in working for one another. Just how well they uh, work together and how they uh, they play for each other. Uh, it's, that's what's special about them. Um, they're all great teammates, uh, and they just bring great effort every day, and that's something we stress, and that's something we talk about. I'm just so proud of them for that. We work for each other. It's it's something special. And, you know, we wanted it so bad for each one, each and every one of us. You know, it, it's it's awesome. I love how we all stay together. Whether it's the younger kids and the older kids, we all are friends. We all do everything together. Yeah, that's it. We're family. We love each other like we're family. Reporting for KX, I'm Brandon Garden. The Sioux return a lot of key players next year and will look to repeat as champs.